All right, let's go over working with points a little bit. I uh, opened the uh, default man topo drawing and erased the pile, set a coordinate file of uh, I've got uh, a man just a man topo CRD set, and if I list points in that file, all points, there's nothing in there, so it's a completely empty file. So really these points are just points on the screen and I don't have anything in the coordinate file. So to get them in the coordinate file I need to do a points coordinate file utilities update coordinate file from drawing. Now it's going to ask me for a wild card match for the description. So I'm just going to hit enter because it'll just use whatever description those points have. Update point descriptions. Yes that doesn't really apply in this case because there's no points in the file so yes or no it doesn't matter it's gonna go ahead and put the point descriptions in there um, and now it wants wants me to select the entities so I'm just gonna select everything here if I only wanted to put a certain set of points in the coordinate file I could just select the ones I want uh, I'm gonna select everything and now it tells me it's written 356 points to the coordinate file. Now if I list the points all, we'll see the points are in the coordinate file. Now if I use the move commands, edit move over here and move these points somewhere else on the screen, move them over there, it's only moving them on the screen. The coordinate file is still going to have them here. So if I go to points, draw locate points, draw all, it's going to draw them right back there. And it erased the where I moved them. Okay, and that's in the point setting. Draw locate points. Um, let's see. It's uh, erase duplicates. If you have that unchecked. If I uncheck that, I'm going to cancel that and move these points again. If I move them over here and then do points, draw locate points, un erase that, and then draw all, now I'm going to have both sets. So, but if you don't, if you move the points and you want this to be now in the coordinate file and not that I'm just going to erase all these so now I just need to go to points coordinate file utilities update coordinate file from drawing enter and update point descriptions now if you wanted to keep the descriptions that are in the coordinate file and not the descriptions that you've modified here in the drawing then you would select no but if you want the descriptions you've changed here on the drawing points to match in the coordinate file then you would do yes in this case it doesn't really matter because we haven't changed anything so now it's wanting me to select the points that <clears throat> I want to update in that coordinate file so I'll just select all these points and it's telling me that I have uh, point number three in the coordinate file it's this in the new point it's this so it was located here now it's located here and it's asking me what what should it do does it do I want to overwrite it do I want to renumber it um, so I'm just going to renumber all or overwrite all sorry if I renumbered them it would just create a whole other set of points so then I would have the old and the new in there so overwrite all is going to overwrite everything so now if I do a list points all we see you got negative elevations where I move those points and the coordinates are all different so now if I erase these and then do points draw locate points uh, you 
you can do erase duplicates on or off it doesn't matter I already erased them and draw all now they're where we moved them to so that's basically all there is to it now if you went into the coordinate file and modified the coordinate file and wanted a point drawn to the screen it would be just the opposite coordinate file utilities update drawing from the coordinate file so I believe in your drawing you had moved a set of points and then rotated them with the rotate command wherever it is I always type it so um, I'll just do a standard rotate and rotate them around say like that so again they're just rotated on the screen and moved on the screen in the coordinate file they're still in the same point in, in this old place so I need to do points coordinate file utilities update coordinate file from drawing wildcard match enter update point descriptions enter select the entities and overwrite all so now they'll be up to date now let's see I think in yours you maybe have a duplicate set so you've got some that are not rotated and some that are and you would need to either turn off or erase or some way make it so you can select the ones that you want to keep because I mean, when you go through that selection process it's asking you to select the ones you want to keep I think one of the other issues you had is you had some other points that were way out in space somewhere else and you keep erasing, erasing them and then when you redraw the points it puts them back and I just copied a section of them down from here down uh, and renumbered them all so now I have a group of points down here so basically what what's happening is you're erasing these points using the erase command like edit erase select and then selecting those and erasing them and they're gone off the screen but they're still in the coordinate file so if I do points draw locate points draw all it's going to put those points right back on the screen now if I want to get rid of those points from the coordinate file and the screen I use, need to use the coordinate file utilities or erase points here um, if, if I use the erase points from the points menu it's going to ask me if I want to delete them from the screen it's going to ask me if I want to delete them from the coordinate file so it's asking me to select the points from the screen group or point number and we're just going to do from screen so I'm going to hit S enter select the entities I'm going to select all those and and delete points from the coordinate file yes or no if I say no it's just going to delete them from the screen just like I was doing a normal erase and they would still be in the coordinate file so if I drew it again they would just show up again so this this is the way you want to get them out of the coordinate file so they don't appear again so delete points from the coordinate file yes are you sure you want to delete the points from the coordinate file yes delete point symbols yes so now they're gone so now if I do points draw locate points draw all they don't come back now here's another option you can let's just make a copy of these points again copy standard copy I'm just gonna copy a section of points down and over here and give us something to work with and I'm gonna do points uh, coordinate file utilities update coordinate file from the screen enter um, enter select entities I'm gonna select everything there and I'm gonna renumber all of those so that I have another set of points so now if I erase everything and then do a points uh, draw locate points draw all again we see that we now have those points back in the file again now here's another option for you 
you can go up here and do points set coordinate file and just set a new coordinate file I'll just call it man topo uh, moved so that'll give me a completely different coordinate file now if I just want this set of points in that coordinate file I can go to points coordinate file utilities update coordinate file from drawing and wildcard match enter update descriptions yes and, and then select the entities that I want in that coordinate file okay so now if I exit that I erase everything from the screen and then do points draw locate points draw all it's only going to draw the points in that coordinate file so that's another way of getting rid of the other points without doing the erase now if I switch back <clears throat> to the other coordinate file um, oops wrong thing uh, set coordinate file and go back to the original man topo that I was in and I do points draw locate points draw all it's still got the other points in it so I can deal with more than one coordinate file in this drawing and there's other options in that coordinate file utilities to merge so copy merge a coordinate file so if I wanted to merge this coordinate file I could export points out of this file to the other one or I could import points from a different coordinate file into this one so there's there's options there to move the points around you just gotta think of uh, what files those coordinates are in and what's being utilized so everything over here under edit these are all CAD based commands and are only affecting what's on the screen everything under points 3d data that type of stuff is uh, modifying your coordinate file so another option would be if I wanted to move these points from one place to another I can do the points uh, move points e, where the heck is it move no uh, coordinate file utilities translate points and that's going to translate them from one place to another and I can pick the points to move or range um, I can just pick the origin point from here I want to move them from there to destination point there um, and I can turn the Z's on to process the elevations if I want um, and I'll process all points and then it moves them from one place to the other so it's moved them from there to there the same with the rotate so if I do points draw locate points now draw all that's where they are okay they're not in this old position over there and same thing with rotate um, it's under coordinate file uh, adjust coordinate files also rotate there's also the move points down here translate move points uh, move points works from uh, selecting as like a single point and we don't want that so that just moves one point um, and it does it, it moves it in the coordinate file so if I do points draw locate points draw all again that point is still over there didn't just move it on the screen it actually moved it in the coordinate file um, points adjust coordinates rotate points and same thing I can pick say I want to rotate from this point around that point and then it asks me for references so if I wanted to rotate here to here as the old and <clears throat> Well, it's actually me defined by points. I can pick the points or an entity. So if I had, let's just cancel out of that. So if I had a rotation 
of a polyline. Um, say I wanted to rotate from this angle to this angle. This is original and that's new. The points adjust coordinates, rotate points. I want to rotate around a particular point or I can just do it from the end point there and the reference I can pick is an entity I want to pick this line and pick the new entity and pick that line and then rotate them all and that rotates all my points both on the screen and in the coordinate file okay I hope Hopefully that'll help you resolve some of the issues with your with your points and if you have any qu more questions just let me know